nuclear energy is so important to the United States from, from a long-term point of view. If you look at the question of energy security and where are we going to get our energy now and in the future and what is it going to mean for my kids, I think it's extremely important that the United States uh, reduce its dependence on on importing foreign oil, for example, so that we really have a little bit more control over our future. We're not so beholden to what others want us to have or, or not have. So I think nuclear energy is, is, is the key to that. I, like to I lead systems analysis activities for nuclear energy development and with a focus on the fuel cycle. So how does this system all work together when you look at all aspects of it from the very beginning mining and milling to the very end dis disposition of some kind of waste? I look for how the pieces fit together. Now there's obviously uh, the issue of waste. What do we do with the waste? So. In nuclear energy, I actually see that our waste issues are much easier than many other technologies. We don't, our waste products don't go into the air. They're solid waste that we can point to. Here it is, and now we have an opportunity to do something with. And we're looking at technologies that would allow us to recycle that because although it's called waste, it's really got an energy value in it. There's a lot more energy value in a, what, what's called spent fuel. Currently what we're doing is, is storing that used fuel on site at the commercial reactors. So as we move into the future, what we're looking at is, well, what might we do in terms of recycling that material? And there's research going on, uh, new technologies being developed. Recycling is happening outside of the United States. Japan and France both recycle. They're only recycling a component of that used fuel, but it is a start. And what we're looking at is technologies that would actually enable us to recycle almost all of the material in that used fuel.